Yo, welcome back to the channel everyone. Hope you guys are all doing well. It's Oscar and we're back again with another video. Today we're going to be talking about something unique, something pretty cool, and something not too old. But today's topic is going to be Bellagio 10 and $20 first edition chips. Why they're so rare, why they're so expensive, and um, just a little bit about them. So hope you guys enjoy. Let's get into it. So, like I mentioned, today's video is going to be about the Bellagio 10 and $20 first edition chips. Um, yeah, something, I wouldn't say something that most people don't know about. It's something um, you definitely, I mean, you see them, but you don't. So, it depends on what condition, who's looking for them. Um, I remember, so I started working at Spinetti's back in 2018. I wasn't at the store until, I believe it was maybe June or July 2018. Um, we had, I think it was a Bellagio 20 actually, and I don't remember it 100%, um, but we were only asking maybe $30 or $40 for this chip. Um, if we did have a 10, we weren't asking much for it either, but COVID happened and prices of these first edition Bellagio chips blew up. Um, I mean, people, you know, were getting $100, maybe $200 a piece. For the 20s and people were thinking that was crazy the 10s were going for like 60 maybe sometimes over a hundred um i think they were mainly 60 70 80 dollar chips but still you think for first edition chip um i mean you see this a lot with with uh you know older casinos they have first edition chips they just don't go for that much for some reason these bellagio chips they go for a stupid amount of money and uh, especially, you know, being in this condition, you never, never, ever see these two chips as sharp as these two. And I mean, I think the person who probably got these got them maybe within the first week or first two weeks of Bellagio opening or maybe the for opening night because these two, I mean, these two chips are razor sharp. They're some of, some of the, the sharpest Bellagio first edition chips I've ever seen. So, um, what's unique about them, I guess? They're both poker chips. Um, so, as you can see, they both, on the inlay, they say poker there. They say poker there. So, that means these chips were only used in the poker room. You would have never seen these chips on the, you know, the main floor, let's say playing blackjack, uh, pie gal, craps, roulette. You would have never seen these chips on the table. These chips were only used in the poker room. So, you know, back in the day, and they still do, they had 10 20 games, 20 40 games. So these chips were being used there. I don't think they were used in any, let's say, 1, 2, 5, 10 games, mainly because whatever game you're playing, let's say you're playing 2, two let's say you're playing um, 1, 2, you're going to have a lot of $1 chips on the table, you're going to have a lot of 5s. The $1 chips are your blinds. Fives are going to be the ultimate work for, workhorse. These chips, you're playing 10 20. Tens would have been your small blind. $20 chips would have been your big blind. And uh, yeah, I mean, look how sharp they are. You never see these two chips this sharp. Never see them like this. So this is truly a treat to, uh, to have these in a video. These are my chips. These are actually Spinetti's chips. I was just borrowing them just to make the video. Um, just because they are so so sharp like I said you just don't see them in this condition um, I don't know I saw them today took it out of the airtight and I was just I was absolutely amazed so yeah that's primarily the key another key little thing as to why they're so expensive they're odd denominations um, I know there's quite a few people that collect um, odd denomination chips whether that be two uh, three four uh, 8, 10, 12, um, I think this is a 12 and a half cent chip. There's some, there's some crazy, crazy odd denomination chips, but these two being a 10 and a $20 chip fall into that, uh, odd denomination chip little realm. And, uh, yeah, like I said, they're beautiful. The, the Bellagio is, I believe it's, uh, it's not Arquillo, it's a blaze orange, I believe. Um, super, super, super cool. Like I said, this thing, super sharp. The Bellagio, super sharp. And, uh, yeah, I don't know. The Bellagio has eight V spots. This just has, like, uh, four edge spots. I don't know what the edge spot pattern for this one is. Both house mold, 
both beautiful simplistic first edition Bellagio artwork and just absolutely amazing so they're pretty cool they're pretty beautiful um, I don't know, you can't go wrong with them so like I mentioned today's video is just gonna be simply that I wanted to talk about why Bellagio first edition chips are so expensive why they're so hard to find um, what's the kind of the rarity what's the coolness what's the uniqueness about them and uh, yeah hopefully the quick little video went over that there's not too much to say about them they are beautiful they're rare they are expensive to uh, some degree. I think the last Bellagio 20,000 mint condition I looked it up today sold for $600. They're generally in used condition selling around somewhere around 200 to 50. And uh, the last couple of Bellagio $10 chips I've seen, they've been selling for about 98 to $100. Um, most of them all used though. I, I haven't seen one brand new mint condition Bellagio 10, um, you know, as the research I'm trying to look, can't find one. So. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please drop a like. If you have any comments, put those down below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.